Hey everybody, this is a book uh, called The Pyramid by Les Brown. It basically goes into all the details on how to build pyramids and the little tricks that he uses to make them perfectly lined up. Uh, he builds them like the Pyramid of Giza. Uh, it's an interesting book. I'm not going to say too much until we get into the further chapters. I might point out bits and pieces here and there. Uh, as you may be aware in reading right here, this is the uh, person who had put out the book. And they kind of start the book off by reading their own opinion or writing their own opinion at the, uh, at the beginning. But we'll let it run through and we'll take it from there. All right. Remember, everybody, don't forget to like and subscribe and do all that jazz we all don't like doing, but we do anyway. Again, as I've said before in the past, feel free to pause, slow the video down, speed it up, mute my voice out, whatever it takes. Let's just get this information out to everyone and anyone who's interested. As we get into the further chapters, I'm sure you'll hear me sticking my two-bit opinion into the, uh, the middle of it all. <laughs> Just warning it. <laughs> I've been doing research on pyramids for quite a few years. And uh, Les Brown was definitely an inspiration in all this. Especially in the further chapters. And I'm not sure if he speaks about it on, on here. But in videos that he's done. He speaks about how he built a 30 foot wood pyramid and he had decided to hook it up for electricity and when he grounded it out it threw him 30 feet and knocked him out cold it's a very interesting story indeed In this uh, video that we're doing here today, it's basically a short introduction to the Les Paul book. I believe we'll get into the second chapter towards the end of this. I'm not exactly sure how far I went with this video. <laughs> As I'm still doing it. <laughs> like I said before, mute my voice out. It's easier to read. <laughs> There are some key points right there as to what this book is going to show you. What pyramids do and how they're built. Purposes behind them. This is a neat diagram. It's a diagram of the Pyramid of Giza and its angles. This here, as it gets into in the book, is a grid that Les Brown put together for um, exciting his seeds. 
And I know there's somebody in the comment section that's going to recognize that picture right there. Kind of like what they had done on a 3D post in a private chat. Very interesting work indeed. That pyramid in the background there is the, I believe, the 30-foot pyramid that Les Brown had built in his backyard. All right, everybody, we're coming to close. We're coming to the end of this short video as an introduction to this book for Les Brown called The Pyramid. Thank you for your time. Thank you for your patience. And I hope you all have a great day.